Day and it's Mother's Day today. Happy Mother's Day, everyone. I thought I would start a vlog because I haven't done a vlog since this whole COVID drama started. And I just think that, you know what, it's time to do a vlog so that I can show you guys how I'm coping in terms of COVID and everything else that's happening. It's crazy, you guys. Um, yeah, it's really crazy times. It feels so weird to be um alive in times like this but you know i'm just so glad that we're still fine and i'm praying for everyone and just okay, wishing so, everyone um it's tuesday the first day of the locked after the prime minister has announced the lockdown and i'm working from home today uh i'm feeling positive and i'm remaining positive i'm just having um a yogurt some berries and some honey and some walnuts and a cup of coffee I plan on staying healthy. I'm going to try and go for a walk later today. My ankle is still painful from the fall that I experienced. Don't know if I posted that vlog yet, but I'm going to post it. Uh, what's on my eyelashes is glue from Sunday when I was wearing lashes. It just won't come off. Um, let's just remain positive. It's a really hard time and it's a very serious time, but we've got to stay positive. I think I just want to give out a big shout out to all the healthcare staff. Uh, particularly the, the ones working in frontline NHS, um, the carers providing support at this time, both formal and informal, the volunteers, everyone who is taking part in COVID, uh, particularly, you know, everyone just really fighting and helping where there's a need. Shout out to my fellow social workers as well. It's such a hard time for all of us, but we are pulling through because of the spirit in us to just beat this. Um, so yeah, let's see. We've got 20 more days to go until the Prime Minister reviews the situation. We could be staying longer, depending on what happens. So we just got to have to stay positive and support each other. Video call, do things. I don't know. It's such a hard time. But we'll be okay. We have to be okay. Okay? Um, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye. And these are the ingredients. And that's the skillet. Whatever. Yeah, I'm gonna go walking after I finish cooking. Yeah. I just pulled up at my local Tesco and I wanna show you what it looks like. It's barricaded in the middle. So I wanna find out what that is all about and I will let you know. So this tape is for social distancing. You can't be standing next to people unless it's that distant. Good morning guys, it's Thursday, just listening to the news, uh, about to start work, sun is shining, it's such a nice day, it's, I think it's going to be a nice week this week they say, um, what was I going to say, um, yeah so I'm just making a coffee and I'm having um, a yogurt, today I don't feel like fruit so I'm going to do my footies for bunting if you guys know. Um, yeah, I need water. I need to go and get water. Yesterday, I went to Tesco and completely forgot I'm not under water being a priority. I'm left with just two bottles and I do two a day. So, yeah. Uh, where was I? Yeah, so that's it. Thursday, Aluta Continua. I hear the number of deaths has decreased, which is really good, guys. It's I. So, tonight, I am making um, a prawn pumpkin pie using my leftover pumpkin from the other day. And these are my ingredients i've got lime i've got these vegetables i'm gonna make my own parsley sauce but i'm gonna use coriander instead <laughs> guys i can't even but yeah that's what's gonna happen i'm gonna use fresh cream for that and we're gonna use some parmesan and a bit of cheddar my fridge is looking crazy empty corona guys yeah so that's what's up that's what's up guys those are my ingredients good morning guys it is a friday friday it doesn't even feel like friday open the curtains it's friday it's a new day um yeah and still in quarantine lips crusty as f about to make a french toast crazy oh it's crazy but yeah, it's Friday. Let's see how it goes. Let us see how it goes. Let me open the blinds. Hey guys, so it's Sunday and I'm just about to film a video for you guys on self-care whilst you're in lockdown. And I just wanted to share what I'm actually doing. I've done this already. 
to this morning i've got a rosemary and watermelon candle and i'm having a mint tea because i feel a bit bloated but i always kind of have a mint tea like every morning and then this is for later for my immune support it's very important at the moment starting to hazel she's like girl you gotta watch your chicks they're getting a bit chunky i'm like girl you know you're so right like i've been having cheese i've been having a lot of pumpkin with like cheese and stuff like that which is okay on the bunting but i haven't been exercising a lot which soon makes a difference for me so it's crazy so when hazel say that i just really could not even do so this week i'm back on like greens like i'm literally doing just salads and just gonna keep it really healthy this week because i can't afford to go back to where i was like it's driving me mad just thinking that i've put on about um two kilos since the lockdown it's mad guys and sometimes you can't it's not about what you're eating it's just what's actually happening i've got hair you guys see it a strand of hair it's driving me mad i've got a little bin here that's why i'm putting it I'm not throwing it in the sink just in case you're thinking yeah so yeah guys that's what's up i'm gonna do my self-care video and um, show you guys how i'm self-caring and what i'm doing yeah i'm wearing this gown that's from um fashion nova i got this for our birthdays in october i got hazel a pink one and i got myself a black one um yeah so i'm just gonna let my mint tea brew yeah i'm gonna let my mint tea brew and then see what to do from there later guys